Hey guys, it's the Soil Cloth here, and today in this Monster Legends analysis video, we're going to be going over Rusty Redtown. I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not he's worth getting out of his current breeding event. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Rusty Redtail is an attacker, and his traits are Hardened, Control Immunity, and Nature Hater. Control Immunity is amazing. That is definitely his best trait. It is very, very good. The other two are alright, I guess. The last one's very situational, but it's still decent. And then his relics are Sword Sword, which are pretty alright, but you can't get any stamina back with those so it is kind of annoying you could definitely have better relics now let's go down to the pros and the cons all right so he's the second highest power stat in the entire alpine era which is amazing he has crazy damage output five ways of boosting his damage output so basically he just does a ton of damage and then his fire weakness helps him counter his own element which is really good he also has burn and ignite which are both really good and those can both do more damage with the fire weakness which is really cool and then he has access to torch immunity surprisingly low cooldowns and stamina costs and double sword relics are good for extra damage but like i mentioned earlier that is also a con because they don't give you any stamina regen and then he also has a med trait except control immunity which is kind of true he's fire in a water meta low life and very situational hater which is also very true i mentioned that earlier as well and now let's go on down to his moveset so he has an aoe burn which is pretty good he also has a single target 70 fire damage ignite and fire weakness which is really good and then he has a insane self nature hater with double damage which is pretty good that can definitely help with his damage output and then he has a triple damage with a torture immunity which is amazing and then he also has a 45 fire damage with zero cooldown and a 50 fire damage with self damage boost with zero stamina so yeah, he does have some insane damage moves right there and those can also do even more damage if you have nature hater on the enemies so yeah some really insane damage options here he can do a lot a lot of damage especially if you set up the triple damage or double damage first and yeah then you just do a ton a ton of damage so yeah i definitely do suggest that you guys get rusty red tail he does so much damage he's just a really good attacker especially right now since he is kind of newer not super duper new he's in the alpine era so he was an era ago but he's still kind of new since that was the last era so yeah definitely go and get rusty red tail he's pretty great he's a pretty great attacker and he's free right now in the breeding event so yeah definitely worth getting so go ahead and get him out of his breeding event and yeah let me know down in the comments if you guys are going to get him or if you guys are going to use him and i'll see you guys in the next one over to like share and subscribe goodbye